The Seahawks host the Chicago Bears in a rare snow game in Seattle, and while they will have a few players back after missing last week's game in Los Angeles, COVID-19 is still impacting the team's roster here in Week 16. Seahawks Lumen Field blanketed in snow for Bears game first, the good news. The Seahawks will have leading receiver Tyler Lockett back after his bout with COVID. Lockett, who missed his first game of the year last week, leads the team in receiving yards and is tied for the team lead in receptions. Running back and special teams ace Travis Homer is also back after sitting last week out. As far as who's out, the Seahawks have five players on the current roster inactive for Sunday's game, running back Alex Collins, defensive end Kerry Hyder Jr., linebacker John Radigan, quarterback Jake Adeson and defensive lineman Dakota Shepard. Collins and Hyder missed last week's game as they were on the reserve-slash-COVID list, and while they did not carry an injury designation heading into Week 16, that pair will not suit up. Eason and Shepley have been regular healthy scratches for the Seahawks all year long while Radigan suffered a knee injury in last Tuesday's loss to the Rams that likely ended his rookie season. The Seahawks also have five members of the 53-man roster who are still on the reserve-slash-COVID list, and those players all are key contributors. Starting cornerback DJ Reed is out for a second straight week, and Bless Austin, who started for Reed last week, was placed on the reserve-slash-COVID list over the weekend. With those two out, Sidney Jones and John Reed are expected to be Seattle's starting cornerbacks. The team also has Nigel Warrior as an option, defensive tackle Brian Mona, who has been a steady contributor this season, is also out for the second game in a row, as is starting right tackle Brandon Shell.